So guys, today I'm back with a brand new video. I'm gonna be showing you how you can get stretch resolution in Fortnite Chapter 2 Remix. I will also be covering the best resolutions for all PCs, so you can benefit from increased visibility, lower input delay, and higher FPS. Please drop a like and subscribe to the channel, as I'm on my way to 2,000 subscribers. For mid to high end PCs, we have 1720 by 1080, 1650 by 1080, and 1440 by 1080. Using any of these will make you have better aim because enemies' models appear bigger, which allows you to track enemies easier. These resolutions also give an FPS boost and reduced input delay. As for low end PCs, you should use 1024 by 768, 960 by 720, and 800 by 600. When using these stretched resolutions, you will notice that the visibility isn't great, but you will benefit from the FPS boost. Now that you have some recommendations, I will show you how to apply stretched reds. All right, for method one, head over to your desktop and press the Windows key and R at the same time. This will then bring up the run box. Inside of this, type in the following command, percent symbol, local app data, percent symbol, and then press enter. This will bring up this folder. In here, scroll down until you find the Fortnite game folder. Double click on the Fortnite game folder, then open up the saved folder, then config, and then the Windows client folder. Inside of here, you will find your config file, which is the game user settings file. Before we start editing our game user settings, right click on it, click properties, and make sure that the read only box is unchecked. If it's checked, you cannot edit the file, so make sure it's unchecked. Once you've done that, right click on the file and then press open. Once you're inside the config file, scroll down to almost to the bottom of the way down until you see two sections about resolution. There will be one section here, resolution size, X and Y, and then just below that, a last confirmed one right here too. There should be basically two groups of four. What you want to do is change all of the resolution settings to match your desired resolution. For example, my default resolution is 1920 by 1080. And if you want to change it to 1720 by 1080, for example, go ahead and replace all of the ones that have 1920 by 1080 with 1720 by 1080. Once you've updated all of these, press file, then save. After saving, close the file. Then go back to your game user settings file and right click on it. Then tick the read only box. This will prevent Fortnite from automatically changing your resolution back to native, which it will try to do. Once you do that, you are all good to use your new stretched resolution. If you do want to go back to normal resolution, right click on the game user settings file, go into properties, uncheck the read only box, click apply, and then OK. Then you want to open the file and inside undo what we did earlier. Literally change everything back to what it was before. So revert everything to your native resolution. Once you've done that for both sections, don't forget to save the file. When you launch the game, you will be back to native resolution. Now on to method two. To start, right click on your desktop and open the Nvidia control panel. If you don't have it installed, go to the Microsoft Store and download it from there. Once inside the control panel, go to Display and select Change Resolution. Here, click on your main monitor for gaming and make sure that you have selected the highest refresh rate available. Next, select 1920 by 1080 as your resolution or your native res. Then click on Customize. A customized box will appear. Make sure to check Enable Resolutions Not Exposed by Display, as this is essential. Then click Create Custom Resolution. In this window, enter your custom stretch resolution. For example, I'm going to use 1720 by 1080, but you can choose any stretch resolution that suits your needs. Click Test. A black screen may appear briefly, but don't panic. Afterward, it will ask if you want to save the resolution. Click Yes. Another black screen may appear, but once it passes, you will see the custom resolution. Click OK. Then apply it to use the new stretched resolution. If your screen goes black again, don't worry. To revert to 1920 by 1080 on your desktop, simply select the native resolution and click apply. Once that's done, head over to display, adjust desktop size and position. Under adjust desktop size and position, select your main monitor and set scaling to full screen. 
to avoid black bars. Additionally, set Perform Scaling On to GPU, which is important for this setup. Make sure to check Override the Scaling Mode set by games and programs. And that's it! Your stretched resolution is applied. And if this helps, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content.